This film was made possible by a grant from the Colgate Palmolive Company, worldwide leaders in dental research and oral care products. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Yes, you, with the teeth. <laughs> but allow me to introduce myself. The name is Plaque. B. Plaque. That's B for bacterial. Actually, I already know you. Oh, yes, very well. Especially your mouth. I'd venture to say I know your mouth better than you two. I should. I live there. <laughs> it's quite comfortable, really. Warm, cushiony, and it has everything I want. Your teeth and gums. <laughs> Didn't you know? I deal in tooth decay and gum disease. And I love my work. You can't see me, of course, because I am invisible. An invisible film, to be exact. A most satisfactory arrangement for me. I find it a decided advantage for collecting these. But come, take a closer look. Closer. Don't be afraid. They don't bite. Not when I get through with them. These belong to a lovely young girl. With a craving for sweets. The gooier, the stickier, the better. The better for me, Plack, because my invisible film is infested with hundreds of millions of bacteria. The tribe on all those sticky, gooey, sweet things you eat. I spread them along the gum line at every crevice inside and out. When they get together with the sugary remains on your teeth, they produce devastation. A decay acid that can eat right through the enamel to the very heart of your tooth. See what I mean? <laughs> now this young fellow had an unfortunate failing. 
He could never remember the right way to brush his teeth. My bacteria had a ravenous time in his mouth, especially between his teeth. Like here. Of course, dental floss was too much trouble. Oh, once in a while. But every day, not a chance. But this is my prize. Perfect. Not one single cavity. Yet I got it just the same. I spread gum disease. Here and here. All around that tooth. But since the owner didn't see her dentist regularly, she didn't realize it until her gums were so weak, they couldn't hold on. It was that easy. That's the trouble. You make it too easy. All you care about is your hair, your clothes. You don't really care about your smile, about using an accepted fluoride toothpaste. You make destroying your teeth so easy, there's no excitement in it. No, no challenge. Look, I'll make you a sporting proposition. I'll show you how to beat me at my own game. And you won't do it. <laughs> That's right. I'll show you exactly how to protect your teeth and gums from me. And I'll still win. I know you. <laughs> oh, maybe you don't think I'm in your mouth at all. Then take this disclosing tablet and see for yourself. Now, look in the mirror. See where it's turning red on your teeth? That's me. B plaque in your mouth. <laughs> Think you can fight that? I dare you. <laughs> Look. These are your basic ammunition. Kid stuff, right? <laughs> Don't be fooled. Without them every day, you haven't got a chance. Take the toothbrush, but not just any toothbrush. One with a flat brushing surface and soft bristles rounded at the end. And you'll need a fluoride toothpaste, but not just anyone. A fluoride toothpaste accepted by the American Dental Association. Remember that. If you want to be sure your toothpaste not only cleans your teeth, but also makes the enamel stronger, more resistant to decay acid. <laughs> Personally, I'm against it. Now, let's see you brush to remove plaque. <laughs> oh, marvelous. You'll never get rid of me that way. You have to angle the bristles against the gum line. There, where the teeth and gums come together. That's right. Now brush back and forth with short, vibrating strokes. As if you're polishing each tooth. Gently, though. Now, that's better. Clean like that outside. Now inside. I don't know why I bother you will never remember anyway. Now, scrub up and down with the tip of your brush. Inside your front teeth. Up and down. Up and down. Little, short, vibrating strokes like before. Yes, and don't forget those chewing surfaces. Well, not just there. Get all the way back. Well, not that well. Want your teeth to last forever? Okay, now finish the job. If you prefer not to spend a couple of extra minutes a day using dental floss, I shall be eternally grateful, since that's how you could get rid of what the brush missed between your teeth. Now, slide the floss between two teeth. Then up gently. Gently, I said. Just under the gum line. Then scrape the tooth away from the gum. Be sure you scrape away from the gum so you don't injure it. That's simple enough, isn't it? Keep going, scraping carefully until you've done both sides of every single tooth, top and bottom. You'll be denying me some of my best hiding places, places where I do my work undetected. 
If you'd brush and floss like that every day, I couldn't touch you. Because it takes me 24 hours to start trouble. But let an entire day go by without a thorough brushing and flossing, and no one can stop me. No one but a dentist. Those regular checkups ruin my plans every time. It's a dentist who can remove the plaque you miss when it's turned into hard, destructive calculus. It's a dentist who can apply special strength fluoride directly to your teeth. Now, dentists... Oh, one of these days. Uh, it's time. Time to put you to the test. To find out how much you've learned from our little meeting. Learned about me. About yourself. <laughs> Tell me. How's your sweet tooth? Indulge yourself. Have some chocolate and caramel and all the sticky, gooey, sugary food you want. <laughs> Why not? It's only your teeth. <laughs> ah, lollipop. Cake. Donut. Jelly. Jam. Marshmallow. <laughs> I told you. You can't run away from me. There's only one thing you can do. Fight me. Fight me every day. I've shown you how. Now let's see you do it. Let's see you beat me. It's so easy. So easy. But I know you. You won't do it, will you? Will you? You won't do it, will you? Will you? Will you? Will you?